is everybody doing today? Oh, that's amazing. Well, we have a very special We the Church. We're going to look over everything that we've learned so far. So before that, do you want to sing a song? Oh, that's great. Ready? This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Oh, that was amazing. All right, well, I invited some friends to go and talk to about what we've learned. So let's go see if we can find them. All right, here we go. <laughs> And what's your name? Hi, I'm Gavin. Hi. Oh, don't laugh. All right, so we're here in this beautiful place. And uh, this doesn't look like church. Well, church is not just a place. It's people. It's just the people? Well, no, it's the people within the community that really make it a church. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, it's like what we learned a long time ago. You remember? Oh, let's see if we remember. Here we go. Well, we going to church is kind of an interesting thing because a church is not a place you go to. We are in a sanctuary right now, but you all are in your homes. But we are the church together. So the church is in the building. The church is in the steeple. The church isn't the meeting place. The church is the people. It is. Yeah, so the church is a people that, that God gathers together. Uh, when, we, when we live in the grace of God and we live in God's love, confessing our sin and hearing forgiveness, God makes us into a family, into a group of people where we can not only receive that grace, but we can share it with others and show it to others. That's amazing, Pastor. Isn't that awesome? That's... So, Wendy, you're a part of the church. Awesome. Are you guys a part of the church? Yes. Can I see? Where's the... Oh. Raise your hand. Raise your hand. Part of the Are church. you part of the church? Yay. I don't see you raising your hand, Lily. <laughs> okay. Then so raise we are all part of the church. And we confess our sins and receive God's forgiveness. And that brings us together into the family that is the church, no matter where we are. Oh, that was so much fun. No, but Catherine, I heard you had a confession. Yeah, so I kind of almost missed church last Sunday and... That's not good. Yeah. Yeah. Did you miss church too? Oh, I never missed church. Oh, that's good. Yeah. yeah, so did you confess? Yeah, I did. You did? Remember what we confess? How we confess? You do? Oh, that's good. All right. Well, I think we should sing a song, don't you? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, let's sing a song. All right. Um, Jesus loves me, yes I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him below, they are weak but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me, the Bible tells me so. Sorry about that, it's a little early, so I don't have my voice yet, and I didn't warm up. <sighs> All right, well, we are going to go, and we're gonna go back to see what they're talking about with sharing the peace. All right, here we go. <laughs> Well, that was amazing! Oh, oh my goodness. So, we also learned about peace, sharing peace. Catherine, do you remember what sharing peace is? Gavin, do you remember what sharing peace is? Yeah. What is it? Well, it's where sometimes at the end of a baseball game, yeah. how the Cubs will go around to the other team and then shake hands. Yeah. Like sportsmanship. I don't like Cubs! Well, that's okay. You don't have to. Oh, okay. Oh, well, do you remember what peace is? Yeah, it's just sharing Jesus' love. Oh, that's amazing. I oh, remember that. Let's see if we remember the passage that went from it, the gospel. All right, here we go. Well, what is peace? Maybe you can explain peace to us. 
I can try and help. But I think one of the things to realize is that the Bible says it's all sorts of different things. And it talks about Jesus' peace as the peace that passes understanding. So it's a gift that is so great that we can't even understand it sometimes. But like you learned, peace is a reminder that we're never alone. God is always with us. Right. We don't have to be afraid uh, because God will help us whenever we need help. We can trust, we can trust in God, and we can trust in others, in our faith family, and family, and friends, and the church. Yeah. All those things are right. peace. But remember always that when you have God's peace, you can trust that he's with you, you're never alone, and you are a part of the body of Christ, part of the church. Huh? <laughs> then when we also learn about singing, do you remember why we sing in church, Kevin? Yeah, the song B-I-B-L-E. B-I-B-L-E, is that why we sing in church? No, it's not why we sing in church, but it's something we do sing in church. Oh, well, let's sing then it's right now. Here we go, ready? Here! The B-I-B-L-E, yes, that's the book for me. I stand along on the Word of God, the B-I-B-L-E. So why do we sing in church again, Gavin? We sing in Gavin. church to praise God's name. We praise God's name, is that why? Yeah. Oh, okay, well, that's amazing. Yeah, we remember the Bible verse. Remember how we found the mic stand and we went all the way to Melissa's house? Do you want to hear that again? I know you do. What do you think, Gavin? You want to hear? Yeah, I do. There is a candle in every soul, some brightly burning, some dark cold. There is a spirit who brings a fire, ignites a candle and makes his home. I think it was number 73. 73? Yeah. Do you see any out here? One's over there. Oh, I see it! I see it! Anything else? Um, I think I see one over there. Oh, it's jumping out of the water. Oh, that's so pretty. Wow. Yeah, I think we should count the crosses on the way back to church. What do you think? Yeah. Why not? All right, let's walk with me. Here we go. Ready? Here we go. B-I-B-L-E. Oh, oh, we're back, but I can't see Gavin and Catherine. I think we lost them. They might have stopped for ice cream because, you know, we learned that peace is everywhere, even when we go to McDonald's and when we get ice cream. But, oh, well, you know, one thing that we also talked about was candles. There are so many candles on the altar, and it's so amazing. But, oh, well, we're running out of time. So, but before we go, we need to 
say the creed. And so let's try, ready? I believe in Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Lord. And then I believe in God the Father Almighty. And I believe in the Holy Spirit. Um, I think that's about it. I, I might have messed that up a little bit, but that's okay. Jesus still loves us. And then we have to say the Lord's Prayer. You want to do that with us? Do that with me? All right. So bow your heads, fold your hands. Wait, fold your hands, bow your head. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth that is it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not in temptation, but deliver us from evil. Thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Oh, that was amazing. Oh, good job. Let me play the song again that we learned. You'll catch on really quick. I bet you already know it. It's Jesus Loves the Little Children. Here we go. Jesus loves the little children, all the children of the world. Every color, shape, and size, they are precious in his eyes. Jesus loves the little children of the world. Let's sing it. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, let's sing it. Does everyone want to sing it? Oh, okay, here we go. Let's sing it again. Every color, shape, and size, they are precious in his eyes. Here we go. Jesus loves the little children, all the children of the world. Every color, shape, and size, they are precious in his eyes. Jesus loves the little children of the world. And our next verse is every child in every land, Jesus holds them in his hand. Oh, here that's amazing. Go. All right, here we go. Jesus loves the little children, all the children of the world. Every child in every land, Jesus holds them in his hand. Jesus loves the little idea. Yes, let's pray. Can you read after me? Okay. Dear God. Dear God. Thank you for loving us. Thank you for, for loving, loving us. And thank you for loving everyone. And thank you for loving everyone. Help us to love. Help us to love. As you do. As you do. Well, thanks for visiting out with us today. I hope you have a great week and we'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs> that's not the back for me. I stand alone on the word I got to be. I be.